Now that the system is shut down, we can take out the filter and remove the blower. To do this, we need to take the cover off the blower. As you can see here on this particular unit, we have a circuit board and the furnace drains in front of the blower. We obviously have to remove these in order to get the blower out. We've already removed the screws on the circuit board, so we just need to take it out and place it out of the way. Next, we remove the drains and the hoses. If you need to disconnect any wires in this process, it's a good idea to take a photo so that you can put it back together properly. Now that everything is out of our way, we can pull the blower out. On this furnace, we need to remove a couple of screws, then take the blower out and move it to the side.